People who are visiting Bath at weekends, they often say, oh, I wish we had one of these in our town, because we're quite unusual, really, in the range of subjects, the frequency of the meetings, and the strength of the offerings that we have. So we do have some world-class speakers here. Analysis. Maybe it's better to use the biomethane with CO2 to end up with this process here, either to give you fuels and or various high commodity chemicals. Two theories, two levels of description, are said to correspond if you can deduce one as a special case of the other. They're incommensurate if their foundations are logically incompatible. It's a flashpoint for Tolstoy. He suddenly realised that um, he'd been going about things the wrong way. He hadn't been listening to his own inner voice. I marvel at the fact that we were relaunched in 1993 and we now have 150 events annually. I, I just think that's incredible. The greatest mistake we have made as a species is to assume that we could manipulate the world to our liking as so we could apply the machine. The aims of the institution are served dually by the lecture programme and the collections. This is a stony iron meteorite known as a palisite and it's about 4.2 billion years old, so nearly as old as this planet. This is a, an 1851 model Colt revolver. It has a special feature on the trigger guard here to help you steady the pistol when you fire it. Most unusual. There's a number of ways in which you can display the collections. With the modern technology, you don't have to see the thing, you can see a picture of the thing. And in fact, that can give you a much better idea of what's going on, because you can get much closer with the picture than you can do with a display case. Anybody who walks past the windows and sees this door and this big banner out the front, this is the first room they see. And the fact that it has objects and artefacts in it, I think, is, is fantastic. It's an opportunity for people to pop in from time to time and see something totally different. The Bureauside Library contains over 10,000 books. This is John Johnston's Natural History Catalogue with fantastic etchings. In amongst some of this, you have what were described as real animals at the time, the unicorns. We've got the collections, we've got the lecture programme, we've got the room hire, and we've got the exhibition space. There's something for everybody here. Mm -hmm.